Naturally, the thing to do after we start graphing these suckers is to find the equations for them. And to find the equation for them, we'll just need a center and a radius, which we have right here. The center is this 0, negative 6, with a radius of the square root of 2. Now, we do have the form up there at the top. So, I'm just going to kind of write it above it. Hopefully, that kind of helps us make sense of this thing. So, I would have uh, x minus whatever h is. And we're going to square that. And we're going to add this to y minus k, whatever that is, and square that. And it should equal the radius squared. So if I wanted to find the radius squared, this is the radius. I just need to square it. And that would give us a value of 2. So our radius here is just 2. Now all I need to do is replace the h with wherever the h is. That's right there with the x. And I'm going to replace the k up here with the y, and that would be a negative 6. That's a little sloppy, sorry. Kind of thickness there. Well, all we have to do now is to simplify this garbage. So if I were to bring it down here, I would have x minus 0. That's just x, as it turns out. So I can just make that x squared. In fact, I don't even need the parentheses anymore. And then I can add this to my y. That was minus a negative 6, so I am going to change that now to a plus 6. And I'm going to square that quantity. Of course, all this equals our radius value, which is 2. And this is it. This is really what we're looking for here. Uh, I personally would be okay with this x minus 0 garbage, but on the homework, they're going to definitely want, definitely want you to... Just make that an x squared stuff.